TTO, so, TTO is a guide is a is a automotive marketplace. It's yeah. uh it's well we talking to the consumer, we're talking to the techie people here. Well we're talking to everybody. To everybody, yeah. everybody. All right. Well it's an automotive consumer guide. Yeah. Right. Yeah. That's On, for like, it's all it's all online. Yeah, for the for I the mean, cus- for uh, if I'm speaking to a customer, yeah. It's an automotive consumer guide. It's where yeah. you would go to find prices, yep. specs and ve- new vehicles available here in Trinidad and Tobago. You have all the photos as well, all the photos. different angles. I th- right. You have different co- you have the color options as well. You on, some them, on, on some of them. On some of them. them. Yeah, yeah. Um, if I was speaking to like the techie side or the marketing side of you, mm-hmm. it's a lead generator. Right. That's okay. what it does. It right. generates leads for right. for the auto, auto dealerships and for the insurance companies and finance companies. How did you manage right. to convince them to put prices up? Because I noticed this is something that none of them do. None of, none them, of them put wanted, their prices none on None the of them want their prices there. Right. Okay. Um, it was probably... Um, TT Auto Guy was probably a little either before its time or out of time, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. right? The dealerships in Trinidad, they don't like to show their car prices, yeah. right? They, they, they think that um, a KPI measurement is how many people call to say, hey, what's the price? Right. No, it's, it's not. not. It's not, right. It's not yeah. right? It frustrates people. Listen, exactly. I've, I've managed Facebook pages for, for auto brands in Trinidad. Exactly, yeah. And once you post that car, Price, 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 and then have the, the sales person it start the conversation because okay maybe you can't afford that but here's another car yeah. that you could, could afford it's also you know? a lot of old school marketing yeah. you know yeah. what I mean like before things were digital mm-hmm. yeah like not sure any price would cause foot traffic yeah. mm-hmm. or cause the phone to ring and the phone, phone ringing makes the boss think that we're busy yeah. you know what I mean mm-hmm. Yeah. Where really and truly, what you're really just doing is frustrating. If the, 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 the customers, the, yeah. potential not customers. Not, not, sorry, <laughs> not only just the customers, the, mm-hmm. the your employees, yeah, yeah, the yeah. sales rep. Yeah, you know how many times you have to answer is one fifty nine ninety nine. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. Eight thousand dollars a month, and <laughs> you. you know, you know, it, it's so annoying for them to have to get that rap. And by the time they answer that for the tenth time a day, it sounds like how I just said it. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh god, oh god, yeah. it's, it's one hundred fifty nine thousand nine. <laughs> Like you, how you don't know that, you know? I mean, if if I think of like my, my uh, the consumer journey or whatever for for buying a car, it's you know, first you start with with um with with research. Yeah, well, maybe you see some cars in your road, you think looking good. Oh, I like those cars. Yeah, you know, and then you start to go online. You maybe you go on YouTube, maybe you watch some videos, and then you go on the websites and you check out the different photos and whatever, and then you want to reprice. And then based on the price, like okay, this is my budget, and here are these three cars from these three different brands within my budget and you kind of narrow it down yeah and then you start reaching out to these to these different dealerships to to find out where i could get the best deal who might give me a little discount or whatever mm-hmm. and well you know i had ran some little surveys and when we, when we were starting up and this is actually like what you just said is, is the story of most people is yeah. that they they would take a saturday you know yeah. they would mm-hmm. tell themselves all right saturday we go in we're going to hit all the dealerships yeah and they would end up just going to two right mm-hmm. and they would leave there with a whole bunch of these double printed glossy flyers <laughs> right yeah, yeah 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 with you know cards stapled to them and stuff mm-hmm. like that and they would not they would give up yeah they went to two dealerships you know and luckily for in Trinidad you know you go to two, two dealerships you might see you know five different manufacturers because some of the dealerships have different yeah. manufacturers yeah. Different, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah so yeah. we're blessed like that but they haven't seen all the cars mm-hmm. you know and they haven't had all the um, different uh, uh, opportunities mm-hmm, you know mm-hmm. what I mean because if you ever worked in the back end of a, of a dealership like one of my clients was a dealership mm-hmm. and I was with them throughout their whole um, management leadership sort of mentoring consultancy and you know establishing nice. all their KPIs and it was, a, yeah. it was a great learning experience and one of the main things that you get out of it is that dealerships sell cars by test drives mm-hmm. so you need foot traffic you right. know what I mean yeah. so you need people to want to come in the showroom for the right reason mm-hmm, not just mm-hmm. to say hey what's the price oh, mm-hmm, that's, mm-hmm. I can't, as exactly as you said yeah. I can't afford that I go on yeah. Yeah. Once you, when you get someone into that showroom you want to get their backside into a car and take them mm-hmm. for a test drive yeah because once they drive it they're like yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, see my, I see myself I so see anyways, myself in this so yeah, yeah so TT Auto Guide was really out of like alright I want to build like that um, 
that tool, I guess. Yeah, lead, lead generation. Yeah, no, so I mean, I think it's like I think it's like not just idea. not because just the lead generator, but like that tool that that would help your experience. So you yeah. could at least you and your wife could sit down and say, okay, let's yeah. narrow it down to these five models. Mm-hmm. You know, the three SUVs and the two small hatchbacks or whatever, yeah. and then we could say, all right, instead of having to try to go to all the dealerships on a Saturday, we could yeah. say, all right, these are the two dealerships that, that we, we need yeah. to go to. That we need to go to. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah.